Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to describe how I built an AT89S52 programming shield. Uh, basically, this is an update of my previous video, that is video 18. Uh, in video 18, I describe how to program the AT89S52 using the Arduino Uno. So let me do a quick recap. Um, I built this uh, particular circuit uh, of an AT89S52 system on a breadboard which is shown here and I programmed the AT89S52 using the Arduino Uno. As you can see uh, there are a few uh, connecting uh, jumper wires from the Arduino to the uh, AT89S52 uh, circuit and I thought uh, it would be convenient if I could uh, get rid of all these cables um, by building this circuit on a PCB and that's what I did uh, so I uh, built this uh, on a sh Arduino shield and to do that I drew this schematic diagram uh, using an online uh, software called Easy EDA. You can check it out, check this out on the internet. And having done uh, the uh, schematic, I generated the uh, Gerber file and sent it to uh, the JLC PCB manufacturer for making the uh, PCB and I got the delivery of this PCB within a week and so this is the top uh, layer or the top part of the PCB and this one here is the uh, bottom layer of the PCB okay so the next thing to do was to build the shield and the uh, first component I solder uh, the uh, two resistors uh, that's because they have the lowest uh, profile and then I proceed to, to solder in the uh, two capacitors and then the 12 megahertz uh, crystal followed by the push button uh, switch and uh, the red LED then followed by the electrolytic capacitor and then with followed by the uh, female header pins here And finally, the uh, the zip, the zip uh, socket, and here's the uh, finished product, the uh, programmer. And uh, what I did was to the next thing I did was to uh, plug this on top of the Arduino Uno. And here's the picture of uh, the complete uh, programmer uh, with the uh, programmer shield sitting on top of the Arduino Uno. Okay, having finished, having finished uh, building the, uh, the shield, I proceed to, to test the complete uh, product. And uh, to do that, I'm I have to use a male USB A to male USB USB B cable and connect the uh, the shield the programming shield to my desktop 
and I had no complaints from the uh, desktop and I've got the great power red LED on um, which is the good sign and and then I proceed to plug in the, uh, an AT89S52 into the zip uh, socket and I use the AVR do GUI software to uh, program the uh, AT89S52 uh, microcontroller. The details of how to use this software is in uh, video 18. Uh, please refer to that video. And I then proceed uh, with this software to uh, program the, the chip. And it was successful, no complaints. Uh, from the software. I then removed the uh, AT89S52 from the programmer and plug it into uh, my target board for testing purposes. Here's a picture of my target board and uh, we shall see this uh, target board operating in a short uh, video f following this. This is the target board in operation. Okay, so that's all for this video. I hope you have enjoyed uh, and find it uh, beneficial. I'm sharing the project file for this uh, programmer uh, shield. Uh, I've given you the link uh, in the video below. So that's all for now. Thank you for watching. Uh, see you in the next video. Bye.